An afternoon at Peters Hill Park awaits, but who will be smiling in the sunshine? Leanne Ross was away with the national team last week, so too was Hayley Lauder. The midfielder is one of three fresh faces alongside Amy Muir and Lisa Forrest. Aberdeen had a hard-fought win against Dundee United before the break. They'll need the same amount of fight and then some if they're to cause an upset here. Darcy Miller and Chloe Gover come into Clinton Lancaster's side. Keeping City at bay will be part of Aberdeen's plan. But here is Hayley Lauder, early doors. And the captain has the breakthrough. And off the post, off her left, first time. What a time of it she's having. The first Scotland start in four years at the Pinatar Cup. Bonner swung in. Will it eventually break for Michaela Moore? She tees herself up. And there is City second. Forrest initially stabs to no success. Moore, with a bit of patience, rolls one in. Lauder looms over this free kick. She plays it to the near post, and there is Lisa Forrest to stab home this time. Straight from the training ground. Aberdeen caught out. Jimona cuts in. Fancy's going on a little bit of a roll. In fact, she's galloping here. Still cheating Mona. And that is a sensational solo goal. Aberdeen bystanders with a front row seat to this one woman show here. Lovely footwork from Jimona. Gover. Hoofs that one up to Bailey Hutchison. She has the beating of Kenzie Weir far too easily. And so often the bright light for Aberdeen, Bailey Hutchison yanks one back for the Dons. Out muscling Kenzie Weir. Weir up, crossbar, Weir up again, crossbar again, and for a third time, Kenzie Weir is denied. Just not quite breaking for her there. Lovely little link up with Flores Blom. She still has it. What a lovely one to finish off by Wilma Flores Blom. Just dancing her way through here. Lovely little give and go. Thank you very much, she says. And Jenny Curry with no chance. Amy Muir really is having a joyous time out on that left-hand side this afternoon. What does she want to do? Picks out Carly Gimona, who unleashes a thunderbolt of a strike with next to no back lift. That's the pick of the lot. Check this one out. It's a belter for her brace. Fiona Brown swings one into the back post, then there is Ailey Gambon getting in on the act. Oh, that's just as routine as it comes. Glasgow City once again in seventh heaven. Aberdeen all over the shop there, just dying on this final whistle. Muir into Michaela Moore. And as easy as one, two, three, ABC. That's as straightforward as it will come. Another fantastically well worked free kick routine from the reigning champions. Lauder into Muir. And there is Muir to finish it off. It gets really tight when it comes to the split games. Um, every game's really important. Obviously, the top six are playing against each other every single week, so points are up for grabs and um, the lead can diminish pretty quickly as we found out last season so we just need to keep focusing on ourselves making sure that we get three points in the games that we play um, and hopefully we can push it right to the wire. We just need to uh, you know galvanise, regroup and then just just trying to accumulate as many points as we can and if we can hold on to seventh then, then, then brilliant that's good for us.